Today you will learn what RPA is about. Let's go! RPA stands for Robotic Process Automation. And even though it sounds like we are talking about physical robots here, the term robotic refers to software bots. These software bots perform digital business processes by emulating human actions. Thereby, they automate business processes so that little or no human intervention is required anymore. Let's look at a specific use case for robotic process automation. Say you are a purchaser working in a big company. To prevent out-of-stock situations, you create dozens of purchase requisitions per day. Those purchase requisitions usually exceed certain budget restrictions, so that they run into an approval process. Your supervisor needs to approve your purchase. Afterwards, your supervisor creates a real purchase order out of the purchase requisition. As you can imagine, executing this process manually can be quite tedious. This is where RPA comes into the game. The creation of the purchase requisition, the approval process, as well as the purchase order creation can all be supported by RPA. The bot could, for instance, create a purchase requisition, trigger the approval process, wait for the approval, and create a purchase order. Let's summarize what business processes can be automated by robotic process automation. Basically, RPA can be used for almost all business processes fulfilling the following characteristics. First of all, the business processes should be simple, meaning that the complexity should not be too high. Furthermore, RPA is really suited for time-consuming processes. The processes should be repetitive, meaning that they are executed on a regular basis. And last but not least, the processes should have a high degree of standardization, so there is little to no volatility in the way the business processes are executed. This means that virtually any high volume, business rules driven and repeatable process is a great candidate for automation. And now you should have a pretty good idea what robotic process automation is about. If you like this content, please subscribe to my channel to not miss any more videos. See you next week.